Rockman, and we're here with another episode of Will It Polish? Okay, I have two rocks here that we're going to take out back, and we're going to go ahead and get set up, and we're going to work on polishing them. This one here is a piece of petrified wood. Okay, Arizona petrified wood. Nice little strong branch, maybe. There. And I chose this side here to polish up. And then we have a nice little piece here. See how pretty that is? With the green and the white. Now this is not petrified wood. This is like a green moss agate, I believe. I'll verify it a little bit later here. And that button. We're gonna get this thing working and polishing and see what it looks like. It ought to be really pretty. Okay, so you can see I've got my table set up and we're ready to go. This one's a little bit hard because of the fact that it's got kind of a oval shaped, almost like egg shaped there, but nothing really good to grip it on. So we'll have to see what we can do. We may not be able to get the whole face polished up, but we'll try. All right, let's get going. Okay, as you just saw, we kind of polished up some. Uh, we're using like the 30 grit grinder, metal grinder on it. Now we're gonna go ahead and switch over to 50 grit and start working on trying to get it polished up a little bit. A little bit smoother, get some of those big old scratches out. The wind's blowing today, so we're gonna try to get this done. I had to move away from the wall because it was splashing up back towards the machine. All right. Check it out. Okay, we got it down all the way to the 3,000th grit. So let's take a look at it. All right, there's the first one right there. Looking pretty nice. And then here is the petrified wood. Look at those colors in there. So pretty. Get over here where the sun is shining on it. Woo! Looking sharp. Alright, I want to thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Uh, comment if you would on anything that I'm doing and that and I will see you on the next one if you're interested in any of these pieces that I've been doing you can go to Etsy at Earth Echoes and you'll be able to have the link down below and be able to uh, purchase these items <laughs>